So we just realized something. That is that the Nazis are going to be attacking from Scandinavia and where they were kind of approaching the, the Norwegians and, and they took over that territory uh, because they had a lot of units in Scandinavia because I think they were trapped. So this is not good. Because first of all, we can barely take down one Finnish unit. And, uh, and now we're going to face the Germans. And the, there's going to be multiple German units, it looks like. A lot. They're all here. They are all here. Oh, geez. That is going to be scary. Um, yeah, I don't know. We've definitely kind of slowed down our, our progress that we've made so far. I mean, that, the first few turns in this war, I mean, it was going great. I was like, what the heck's happening? It's getting... It's going bad now, pretty fast. Anyways, uh, let's just go ahead and slowly, you know, do our best. I mean, if we could take over this German city while it only has 35 city defense, that would be great. Uh, I'm going to try that because we're already close there. We, we have units nearby. Um, let me try to get my... Here we go. We'll push him forward. He should still be able to attack. No? Why? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, because of lack of... Yeah, there's an enemy there. He, stop, he stops our movement. Um... Let's attack here. We should be able to... No, he's still not going to retreat. But this howitzer is going to be there for next turn. Uh, Got to be careful of my anti-aircraft getting injured. Um, should I even attack this city or should I focus on attacking this unit? I think I, I think I should... Yeah, let's go, ahead and, let's go ahead and take this guy down. At least try. Who has the promotion? Oh, okay. Um, that was a field gun. Let's continue to give him siege. Let's give him siege, and then we will focus on an attack here. And I want to open up a spot. Like I said, I want to open up a spot uh, next to the city. That is the goal. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. We trapped a ship, a German ship, which we can barely do any damage to the German ships. We actually take a lot of damage back. And uh, what else happened? Okay. Naval units. Okay, we could, yeah, we could definitely use that promotion now. Maybe don't, we don't even need to focus. Well, I mean, we've already trapped that ship, so we'll eventually take it down. Uh, I'm going to watch for convoys uh, in the Baltic Sea now. Okay, so you guys stay there. Uh, looks like we are going to begin to attack this German city, so I, I should probably take a big chunk out of its health already. Or this city, too, but let's, let's do this one first. Yeah. Taking over a German city is much more crucial. All right, so let's attack there. Oh, we are, oh whoops, I'm sorry. We're already done right there. Okay. Well, we need to try to keep this field gun safe. I don't want it to be destroyed. There we go. Okay, so this guy should be done next turn, too. Oh, I've got another infantry. That's right. Okay, well, we'll go here, and we'll just move on. So this small regiment here should get most of the job done against Romania. We just have to really just distract those units. Just hopefully, Hungary just stays and does its own thing. Um, as for Germany, I don't know. I'm going to continue to play kind of aggressive, but... It's starting to seem like a, a bad idea. <laughs> it's starting to continue to seem seem like a bad idea. Let's see what they decide to do. Oh, there's another ship inside of the inside of here. Where where are the British? Where's the British fleet at? Where the heck is the British fleet at? Okay, hold on. I don't want to move away from the front because I, I want to because I know that it's gonna freeze for a second. I want to make sure that I know exactly what the Germans do immediately so I can begin to plan ahead. Okay, so this is when they're going to process their turn. Let's see what we have. All right, not bad. That's fine. That's fine, I think. I think everything is fine. Uh, let's Now let's watch for the city-states. Let's see what Romania does and Hungary does. Glad that, to see that France is still trying to attack. Nice is still under the control of the French, and the Greeks are not even really under bombardment at all from an Italian fleet. So that's good. All right, all right, this is this is good. Whoa, 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 whoa. What city is this? Um, by Romania. Oh, okay, okay, that's 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 fine. You just you took back a, you took back your own city. I was gonna say, however, uh, we are in a situation. <laughs> we are in a situation. Again, conserving my gold. I know, I know, people want me to purchase stuff with the gold, but uh, I actually think it's better to i i personally feel like it's better to hold on to the gold until the last second uh or not the last second but uh until i know exactly what i need right now i don't necessarily know what i need i feel like we need projects because we need better units i think our units are definitely lacking i mean obviously there's some things that we can barely attack um 
I'm glad that Finland got this city instead of the Germans. Let's, let's, so I'm just going to wait. I mean, we're making 100 gold right now, so that's good. And we're doing fine in, in all the resources. So those are, those are positives. I wonder how you got the city back. Well, either way, it doesn't matter. Good for you. Let's just take it back pretty quickly. Or should we just, we should probably be destroying their units, huh? Actually, it doesn't even matter. It doesn't matter because we have this going on. So we'll just take that over quickly. Bam. And let's go up on the hill, get some vision. Okay, good. So there are no units here. They are complete, completely focused. Um, who is this? Bulgaria? You want to help us out, Bulgaria? I didn't think so. Okay, so naval infantry. You know, before I send that down south, I might want to use that here for help. Uh, how well can you, you... Yeah, you can fight these units much, much better. Um... Who is who's neutral or the stalemate? Here's a stalemate here. I'm gonna back you up. We're gonna give you a chance to attack now. There you go. All right. Let's give our tanks a time to a time to rest for a second. Let's see what the Germans do. Put the field gun there. Okay. So naval infantry. <laughs> I mean that was just against that one unit, but maybe we need more of these. No penalty from attacking from sea or over uh, a river. That is pretty fantastic. Let's go ahead and do it. It's only going to take six turns. I like it. I know. I'm worried. I'm, I'm watching game. I'm watching that front. So here comes another another bomber, which, you know, in hindsight, maybe that's not what we need. Stalingrad's going to finish a... Uh, what is this? Oh, yes. Antique, pretty much armored unit. I'll watch over Iran. Everything's fine there. Okay. Okay, so far so good. Let's just focus on let's let's focus on the Balkan region. Yeah, we'll focus on the Balkan region. Actually, uh, let's 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 deal with the Germans first. I might be able to force this these anti-aircraft gun to retreat. If I can get on top of this hill, that would be nice. Oh, oh, let's use the bomber to attack again. It's super useful right now before uh, they build any sort of defensive buildings in the city. So we'll continue to grind it down, and then we might be able to walk into it soon. I don't know if we're going to be able to keep it, but it's still something. Okay, so I've got a howitzer that I can't attack anyone else or anywhere else, so I think we'll focus on maybe trying to push this guy back as best we can. Combat medics. I don't think we need to do that promotion anymore. I think we're going to do fine with personnel. Are we at our maximum material? Pretty much. Flanking bonus. See, we're still doing, we're still getting a lot of damage back. That's the whole thing. Um, we should probably work together. I'll, I'll attack. Yeah, there we go. So that city will fall. Hmm. There we go. Bam. Oh, and we got a promotion. Good. Let's focus on accuracy. And try to get some good promotions. Let's focus on like building up like, uh, uh, you know, three either shock or, or rough terrain or whatever. You know what I mean? And try to get like logistics or something like that. I don't know what the equivalent is for this scenario, but uh, we'll find out later. Uh, we get a big, yeah. Well, we'd be better fighting that. We need. I need to look deeper into the percentages before I just go in and jump in at this stuff. I don't need more mobility because we're not really going to be moving much. Uh, there we go. We have to attack the field gun that's out in the open like that. So the AI is having a big issue with that in the mod. Um, the AI doesn't realize that it can stack units. And we are using that to our advantage because we are attacking those, like, you know, field guns that are out in the open like that. So that's good. That's, that's some improvements. No convoy just yet? That's, that's okay. Okay, you guys all stay there and heal. Uh, wait a second, did you not attack? Oh, you, you, this guy didn't attack. See, I'm taking a lot of damage back, so maybe I shouldn't even be, I mean, I should be trying. I feel like, if, it, if anything, I think my material can hold better than, than, than Hitler's, you know, material stocked. Because he's fighting multiple wars. So I, maybe I can afford to take a lot of damage back. Maybe it's just, that's just my opinion, but I, I think I can. But I don't know if that's how I'm going to approach this. Back to 97 gold per turn. It was nice making 100 gold again. That didn't last very long, though. 
Mm. Everything's going fine here. Looks like we will be able to take this German city over before it gets any defensive city. And that will be a nice, or defensive building. And that'll be a nice front for a while. There's, there's mountains here. Uh, we'll have to defend against these three cities, but we do have the naval advantage. We've kind of trapped um, Hitler's navy. I mean, they could always retreat back this way, but I'm sure they don't want to deal with the North Sea and whatever the British have over here. I have no idea what we're going to do about Scandinavia, and I'm just going to let them do whatever. Right now, these are all cities focusing on wealth, so they're not very useful cities for me, you know, in my empire. So if they take a few over, then they take a few over. Oh my gosh, here they come. <laughs> well, maybe I don't Maybe I don't want that exactly. But I don't really have a choice. I can't, can't bring anything up in that direction right now. So I'm going to leave it alone, and we'll just see what happens. Did, did I finish another project? Oh, that was a project. Ugh. I'm really debating on... I guess I, I do need projects, but I'll just have to use the money to buy units now instead of, like, buying factories. So I'll work projects, buy units. That's what I think we need to do. Don't lose any. Don't lose anything. Don't lose anything. So I'm thinking I'll keep when we take the city over. I'll, I'll, I'm going to keep enough here to focus on. Um, I'm going to keep enough units on along the natural, you know, Nazi front. Natural is key word. Uh, Nazi front after I take the city over, we'll retreat a few. I'm actually not even using a field gun here. I don't know why. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a few more up towards uh, Scandinavia. At least just to slow them down. You know what I mean? I need to at least just slow them down. Okay, so this project has been finished by the French. That's fine. Um, we're going to work in administrative building. And I will focus on continuing to move forward. I've got my infantry. Oh, okay, so they're going to be here to stop us. All right, that's fine. Let's get over this way, and let's bring my field gun for some reinforcements. All right. Romania is putting up a much bigger fight than I thought they would. So is Hungary, though. So is Hungary. Slovakia, not so much. Not as worried about them. I definitely have to attack this. Like I said, I've got to attack when I can. Do we kill it? No, it's still there. It retreated, though. Um... One unit is gone. So we'll take this city over, I think. Oh, no, we didn't. Uh, I can take it over now. Oh, that was a field gun. See, it doesn't have an icon, so it's, like, confusing. I'm, I know it's probably just, like, a mod bug, and it, I, it's probably one of those things that is difficult to, to fix, seems like, but, yeah. Uh, I'm not going to attack this because I know that it won't do any, any damage to it. I'm going to attack this city now because that's next. I want to destroy Romania. I think if I could destroy Romania, that would be a big help. Um, you stay there to watch for the convoys, and we'll attack, attack, and attack. All right, cool. Unit promotion. Let's give him another naval unit promotion. All right, and uh, I'm just super lucky that Hungary and Slovakia and the Germans are not continuing to attack from Budapest. Very lucky in that sense. Uh, Stalingrad. Okay, so maybe that is what we need to do. I don't think I need more planes, but, but then again, maybe I do. Uh, but then again, maybe I do. Do we need more howitzers? I'm actually really feeling more personnel units. We've got so many of them. See, I don't need extra combat strength versus gun units. I don't think that's really useful because then I, I can't attack. I think we should focus either on infantry, more infantry. In six turns, that's not bad. I mean, that's raw power right there. And I can build howitzers later. Howitzers or field guns, whatever I, I, I deem necessary. Um... How much? So we're doing, we're taking like minor defeats everywhere. Here's a range attack, but we still, uh, we, we, I want to really like, I'd love to push this guy back. No, still nothing. Well, if we could kill the unit, that'd be great, but I can't right now. Come on, push it back again. Nice. All right. So here they come. Let me try to consolidate. Let me try to get the field gun. Ooh. Okay, you'll go around then. You're going to have to take your time and go around. Broadcast tower? Yeah, because then you'll be able to... I think you'll build infantry after that. You can build me infantry after broadcast tower. Okay, let's use the field gun to attack the anti-aircraft. Oh, nice. Did we destroy that unit? 
Defeated, yes. And actually, now I can do that. I'm worried about my own anti-aircraft, though. I'm going to back him up briefly. And we're surrounding the city a bit more. I haven't taken over the city yet because I'm actually... I, I forgot that in this mod, it's actually more crucial to destroy the units than to take cities. So... I need to remember that, especially when I get a little bit antsy. And that tends to happen all the time. <laughs> I tend to get a little bit antsy. And, uh, and yes. Oh, I need to do something with that. That's right. Uh, I need to do something with these field guns. I will send them up north, definitely. I'm glad that I gave my, uh, my tanks enough time to, to heal for now. Let's see what city they attack first. If they attack this city, there's nothing I can do. I can try to stop them from taking this city, though. I can try. Uh, I'm actually going to focus on this front than anything else. My naval infantry has been doing a good job, and we're building another one, right? Yeah. Okay, perfect. I, I like it so far. But, uh, but probably going forward, we'll focus on projects, and then I will buy units with golds. I can buy two right now. Hopefully pretty powerful units, two pretty powerful units. Maybe one of those KV tanks, KV-1 tanks or something like that. Okay, good. They're going to focus, it looks like, on the southern city, which is better for me. Uh, I can't do anything about them taking this city. Oh, man, this is such an interesting strategy. I love it by the AI. It, they probably didn't mean for it to happen like this, but I love it. I really like it because I'm not ready for this. Are they sending over everything? No, there's still stuff back in Norway. So they can send over more. This is not it. But this is a way bigger force that I'm actually facing um, in, in traditional Nazi territory. Hmm. Let's see what the city-states do. What are you going to do, Romania? You're down to two cities. You're down to two cities. And then maybe in this case, when it comes to destroying uh, a civ or a city-state like this, take the cities over, then focus on the units. Like if, if they only have one city left, take the city over, then destroy the units because... They won't, they'll get like a huge penalty, right, for reinforcements? Something like that. I think that, I think that might be it. Um, uh, we'll, we'll see. So they didn't even do anything so far. I'm pretty sure that Romania is done as long as Hungary and Slovakia don't continue to press forward. Uh, then I'll, I'll really, I'll, I'll really go hard for this territory. They have two, two, two cities left. All right, so I'm going to attack here, here. Oh, they switched, they switched their boats out. Oh, man. And you know what? I didn't realize that I'm losing a lot of strength from this, this guy. Oh, here's the convoy, too. Oh, dang. Hmm. Yeah, attacking naval units. We're going to have to figure out what we're going to do. But uh, I'm going to stop it right there. Let's go with administrative. And uh, let's, let's stop it right there and, and figure out what we want to do. I think it's time to purchase something and um, and focus on maybe stopping. We need to we, we're not we're not doing that well. We're not doing as well as I as I thought we were gonna do. Uh, but anyways guys, thank you so much say thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.